Shifting gears now, North Korea appears to be tightening its grip on the country's overseas workers. This amid recent reports that high-ranking officials are fleeing Pyongyang out of fear they might be executed under the Kim Jong-un regime. Here's Na Young-kyung with the details. North Korea still seems to be monitoring its workers overseas dispatched abroad to earn hard currency. A South Korean government official said Tuesday that North Korea recently checked upon its roughly 50,000 laborers in 40 foreign countries. This comes a day after Radio Free Asia reported that North Korea called in some of its workers in China, suggesting the regime is tightening its grip on its workers overseas. Speaking on condition of anonymity, the official from Seoul's Unification Ministry also said it's not known at this point whether the move is aimed at putting some of the workers behind bars or simply checking upon their progress. The official added, however, that in general, the regime seems to be keeping a close watch on the laborers rather than recalling them officially. This is not the first time the Kim Jong-un regime has monitored its overseas workers. Officials say the regime took similar actions in July and August last year and during the year this year. But the moves have provoked the curiosity of North Korea watchers, especially in light of South Korean media reports last week that a series of mid-ranking North Korean officials have sought asylum in recent weeks. The reports said ruling party and government officials were seeking to defect to South Korea out of a fear for their lives in the wake of North Korean leader Kim Jong-un's so-called reign of terror. Na Hyun-kyung, Arirang News.